I mean, look, branding in the end, you know, you, you've got a company and I'm not talking personal brand, right? You, you've got a company um, and, and it needs a face and it needs a soul. It needs to come through to a customer, right? So there's basically this entire atmosphere around the company that a customer or a client when it's B2B needs to poke through in order to get to what you're offering, right? And whatever that atmosphere is that you need to poke through, that's that's your brand, right? So it's like, it's your personal brand. It's what you put out there. It's your digital brand. It's, you know, I mean, it's a freaking trade show booth, right? I mean, it's whatever. It's what other people say about the brand too, right? It's like this, this atmosphere around your offering that creates your brand. And you can, to a certain extent, create that atmosphere. You can dictate it. You can think about what do I want that atmosphere to be? How do I create between my offering and, and, and the person, right? How do I create a link? How do I create shared values? How, where, where do we all meet, right? And so that really is branding. I mean, it's, it's a holistic big thing, but in the end, yeah, it's a logo. Yeah, it's a name, but, but it's everything. I mean, it's copy. It's, 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 it's digital. It's offline. It's everything. Does that clear anything up, Mark? <laughs> well, it, it, it does. It does. And I think you made a good point. It's not just a logo. It's that feeling. It's the soul. It's the face of your brand. I like to think of branding as...